recently I was contacted by the nice people over at Auto Hut, which is a German pen and ink manufacturer. And they said, hey, you know, we'd like to send you a pen. Um, you know, can we send that to you and, and you could try it out and, you know, see how you like it. I'm all like, yes. They did, and I mean, straight from Germany, I got this, and this is always, whenever I get something in a nice little shopping bag, it just makes me so happy because it does feel like, or you know, it gives me that illusion that I've been shopping when I haven't. It came in this little Auto Hut shopping bag, and I like how bold their statement is right here because I appreciate direct and bold statements. I really do. In case you haven't watched enough of these videos, you probably can tell that I like very direct and bold statements. And this one says, excellent writing instruments. I appreciate that confidence, I do. Inside this bag, I got a little note and it says, dear Vanessa, that's me, in case you didn't know that. Um, you know, you know me as Pen Gangster, but I'm also Vanessa, it's a little card. Enjoy writing with your own auto hut pen. I believe I will. I also got a little catalog in here, which has all the auto hut lineup of pens. So it has just all, you know, everything in there. It's great. The pen that I was sent was the design number six. And that's what we're gonna look at today. And it comes in, I'm gonna, here we go. Look. It's like the experience of shopping, but I'm not shopping. The pen comes in this nice packaging. It is actually quite, I love the, you know, <laughs> obviously I like the black, I like black and white, um, black and white contrast so nicely. And it's like, yeah, it's just me, whatever. Black and white, it's got a black cover over this white box. And you know what's cool about the Auto Hut logo? And I have to say this being, you know, a graphic designer back in the day, I really appreciate the modernist approach to the Auto Hut logo type. Um, you know, it's just very straightforward. Again, another thing about Auto Hut that I like is that they are straightforward. And I love the contrast of the you know, the bold typeface with the regular typeface, you know, that just touches my heart. So they have it also over here on this postcard. Okay, I'm getting to it already. Okay, just let me have a moment to appreciate graphic design. Oh, look, it's also on this box. <laughs> uh, Auto Hut apparently has been around for a while, founded in 1920. So they've been around for a hundred years. We just haven't seen a whole lot of Auto Hut here in the United States. And I'm wondering why. Because looking online, looking, you know, I did a flip through through this catalog earlier. And I'm just like, their, their pens are like super attractive. You know, it's like, why hasn't Auto Hut been, you know, through the U.S. yet? Um, but I'm glad that they're giving me the opportunity to check out their pen and to give it a try out. So maybe, you know, if, if this all goes well, Word will get out and people, you know, auto hut, auto hut. It'll be on everybody's minds. Again, made in Germany. Excellent writing instruments. Let's lift up that lid. And there's the pen. So it's in this nice protective plastic sleeve in order to keep it safe. And it's actually, you know, Pretty, I think it's a pretty nice bold design in there as well. So to take the pen out real quick, let's see what's underneath this part. Okay, so here's cool, this is cool. So I, all I did, listen, when I got the package, I had to see what the pen looked like, okay? And that's all I did. I took it out, I examined it, and I said, O-M-G, O-M-G. Yes, I'm talking to you in an acronym. My name is on there. That means it's my pen. <laughs> okay, so take out this false bottom and ta-da. 
got all kinds of goodies in there, don't we? Comes with what appears to be, uh, we've got, okay, so we've got ink cartridges in this box, five in each. I'm imagining, let's see, one is black and one is blue. Cool. So inside of this bottom is the international converter with the Auto Hut logo type on there. So that's nice that from the from the start, from the get-go, I know that I can use whatever ink I want in there. Um, I've got cartridges for backup. I've got a cartridge converter in there. So obviously the pen's a cartridge converter in case you haven't figured that out yet. I don't have to go buy this separately or dig around in my, my, my own supplies to find an international standard cartridge converter. So I've got that and that, that's really nice. And then let's see here, there's also uh, some, a little booklet that also comes in here. You've got the, uh, what, what do you call this? Okay, I just gotta read what it says. It says Auto Hut excellent writing instruments. Auto Hut writing utensils for connoisseurs. That might be you too. Who appreciate when writing becomes a captivating experience, quality, design, and functionality form a perfectly matched encounter. Established quality and superior performance since 1920, made in Germany. Yeah, and on the back here, it looks like, I mean, I believe it looks like this pen also comes with a serial number, so you're able to identify your pen. Uh, also, there is a small booklet in here uh, that probably tells you how to fill the pen with ink. And then on top of that, just so you can keep your, your pen looking spiffy all the time, you've got a nice cloth in here to wipe down any fingerprints or anything that might happen. I mean, wow, that is actually very, I mean, I'm like really impressed by all this uh, to not only include, I mean, it, what you open a box, you pretty much just get like, you get your pen. Um, some pens come with a converter, some pens don't, uh, but you usually get like with most brands, you at least get one cartridge of black ink or whatever. Uh, some you get a black and blue ink, but this you get black and blue ink and you get five a piece uh, and the converter and a cloth to keep your stuff clean, which I think is totally cool and very thoughtful actually. Um, so yeah, I, I'm like really impressed by the presentation and I think it's really cool that Auto Hut has provided me with that. Now, Auto Hut also provided me with an ink, yeah cool it's called and I love this because I am a fan of red and roses and so this thing is called red roses this is so appropriate that I'm like so touched by this <gasps> oh my god I might cry give me a moment would you <laughs> they're happy tears so don't fret Otto Hut Germany 1920 fine handmade ink for fountain pens. 30 milliliters, just in case you were wondering. Let's see what the bottle looks like. I always like to see what the bottle design is like. I like it's, again, very straightforward, very minimalistic. Got the logo on top of that cap. Um, just gonna peek in here just to see. So yeah, plenty of, wow, that's gonna be a nice color. Look at that. Is it, don't judge me. Oh my God. It smells like roses. This is so awesome. Sorry, I got very excited there. Wow. This is, oh my gosh, this is so awesome. <sighs> I'm so happy. Oh, uh, wow. I'm like so, <laughs> so like happy right now about all this. Let's take a look at the pen. Cause this is what it's really all about, right? It's a pen. 
So let me take it out of this plastic sleeve. Oh, I got some of my fingers by accident, but it's a pretty shade. This is gonna be fun. Okay, let's look at this pen. I know, I'm like gushing. Can't help it, this stuff makes me, I mean, come on, I'm not, I'm not the only one out there, right? Like you see this stuff, do you not get like super excited about this? I'm just like pumped. <laughs> I'm so pumped right now. Okay, I gotta, I really gotta like pull it in, rein it in here and like calm down. look at the pen all right as I said as I have stated before my name is engraved on there and I think that is so cool but again just like the packaging which obviously I mean the packaging reflects the pen so that being said the pen is very straightforward it's actually you know in its simplicity it is beautiful it has rose gold trim it says auto hut here on the bottom of the cap it's made in Germany and then I don't know if you can see, but the the Auto Hut uh, logo is here as well. The clip, I mean, it's a little stiff, but I mean, I don't even use that anyway, so I don't care. You might care, but I don't care. Uh, let's, we gotta see the nib. I've seen pictures of the nib, but I haven't actually seen the nib yet. So let's, okay. Okay, yeah, it has a metal section, but it goes with everything else with that rose gold trim. Ooh, that nib is pretty. That's nice. Very nice. This looks really nice. Okay, yeah. Uh, nice. It's nice. I like it. Let's see what's in here. Since we know the converter is in the box, let's see what's... Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh it's a short standard international plastic cartridge without ink but actually you know it, it you could probably if you want get a syringe and put ink in there so you have this now if you're into that and yep just as I thought another little cartridge it looks like it is blue ink so there is a cartridge in here so you actually get 11 ink cartridges plus a bonus cartridge to use your um syringe to put whatever ink you want in there so you know you get can do all kinds of playing and experimentations yes it has a metal section but as you know i don't have a problem with metal sections as some of you do i know i always uh i just like making fun of you guys who are just like, oh, metal section oh my gosh that's horrible i think that's gorgeous metal section or not and i like how it's tapered you know just to fit your fingers like that i mean it actually feels very ergonomic and comfortable so let's see let's post it look at that it's quite nice i mean it's beautiful you know what i did see online and i'm probably gonna have to buy it there's a pink version of this so you got a pink and rose gold version that i'm probably gonna have to go get now I love pink too, okay? I like black, white, red, pink, turquoise. Let's add that to the list. That's pretty much it. Yeah. But I think that's a very beautiful pen. Another thing I noticed as I was taking the cap off this is that it's like one, it's not like, you know how you have those pens and the cap, it feels like twist, keep twisting, tweak, you know, just to get the, the cap off. And it's like, okay, already. No, this one is very, one, just one twist. So with one hand, you could probably just, yeah, it's, you know, I don't know if you like to do those little tricks or not, you have one hand to take off the cap or who knows. I've been on the phone before and had to have done this. So there are times where that is necessary. I guess the next step is to ink this gorgeous pen with, and I'm going to have to say, you know, okay, I, I didn't say it. It's white. The enamel is white. So it is a metal, it's a metal body. It is a metal cap, but you know, it really doesn't feel too heavy in my opinion, um, with white enamel. So there I've said it. I can't believe I didn't say that to begin with. I mean, I, I guess it's self-explanatory. You look at the pen and it's like, oh, it's white with rose gold trim. But what you can't determine is that it is metal. It's not plastic. 
So it is uh, enamel on metal. And I'm not, I don't know what kind of metal it is, but um, I'm sure it's very nice metal. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this pen, and I'm gonna ink it up with the Red Roses ink, which smells like roses, so that's really cool. Very excited. look at the Auto Hut Design Number no. 6 fountain pen. It's an attractive pen. It looks professional. The steel nib writes really well. And I just have to say that I'm impressed by the whole presentation. And I think that Auto Hut, I hope it makes it in the United States. I mean, I think there's a lot of pen consumers that would really enjoy this. I mean, it's a very nice pen. And not to mention, you know, it comes with a converter. It comes with ink cartridges. Uh, it comes with, you know, a little polishing cloth, you know, because the fingerprints will accumulate over here over time. But I mean, it's nice. It's nice to have something that's well put together and thoughtful like that. If I knew the head of Auto Hut, you know, the CEO, I would call him up just like I've called other CEOs. Not for real, obviously, I don't have their numbers, but I could get it if I wanted to. I would say, job well done. 
This is very cool. Well, that's all I've got. Thank you so much. And that's how the ink flows.